hate to say it, but my ancestors were not thinking clearly when they decided to bury people on top of a mountain. What was this quest called? Eveline, Varric, and Varric. All right. Fewer than some think. But you never stay with them. No, why should I? But the act of lovemaking is so... intimate. I don't make love. What I do is only skin deep, kitten. Don't worry your pretty little head about it. Keeper did not deserve that death. It was my risk to take. I never asked her to do this for me. She knew you didn't have the strength to resist the demon. That's why it picked you. Why are you doing this? What can I do about it now? Make up for your mistakes. Most blood mages never get a second chance. Listen, Hawk. I don't know what came over me back there in Bartrand's house. I'm glad you're watching my back. You had me worried there. You never have to worry about me, Hawk. What are you having? Edwina, let's get a couple of drinks here. Ah, uh, okay, closure. Hawk? Ah, uh, this is awkward. You? At a loss for words? I should mark this down my calendar. Enjoy this while it lasts. It might never happen again. Look, I just want to say, it has been an honor knowing you. You're a good friend, Varric. I know. It's hard to imagine what you'd do without me. You know it's six years today. Six years since I found you dragging your tail out of Bartrand's office. <laughs> Here's to whatever comes next. I might actually level again. I'm going to be surprised if I actually do. You must join us. Do you see that now? You must stand with Kirkwall's mages. It's not my fight. Is there anything on the writing desk? Let's double check. Good to see you again, Pissette. Okay. Champion, and you are with the captain. None too happy about the accusations against her, I'm sure. You could say that. I saw no evidence to support the claims against her. As I suspected. Then why press this? Some feel that the solution to the current crisis of leadership is to consolidate authority. As long as these complaints continue, baseless or not, they will serve as justification for eliminating the position of Guard Captain. It would be the simplest fix, whether or not I agree. Perhaps I can reason with the people who are complaining about her. If they meant to use reason, they would not be anonymous. But the complaints originate in Lowtown. 
Guardsman Brennan is on that patrol. Why wouldn't she tell me of this? I don't know, but I do apologize for the assumptions of this incident, Guard Captain. It has been unfortunate. It's not done. To Lowtown Hawk, I need to speak to Brennan. What if Brennan had a thing for Donick? That's why she's mad. He was my man. Drama. Guardsman. Why did a Templar have to tell me there is unrest in this district? What's going on? Guardsman? It's Captain Jevon. I didn't report his return because I'm ashamed for him. He's trying to rile the guards against you, but none of us will follow him. You lead better than he ever did. We've made so many enemies. I don't remember him as that impressive. He deserves to be forgotten. He abused his position and blamed me when we caught him. He was well liked by some, but not once the truth was known. Is this the guy that we defrocked uh, as guard captain because he was like he was trying to get other guards in trouble we need to find him guardsman the guards will have nothing to do with him so he found others militia mostly anti ferelden the same kind who were against the canari i guess it's been long enough they've forgotten how many the champion killed a rally Against the tyranny of the guard and foreigners who infest Kirkwall. I'm sorry, Captain. Return to the barracks. The rally is in Darktown, Hawk. I need to be there. Jevon is down there. What up, nerd? The champion? Here. It's the captain. Are we ready for this? Too long, brave Kirkwall. You did not throw off all others only to fall under Ferelden influence. Leaderless, displaced, alien hands on the most basic authority. Foreign elite bleeding you! Jevon! You disgrace yourself! The Ferelden with the Elysian name! 
Is there anyone else who so embodies how far this city has fallen? This one is all yours, Captain. Do they know how you sacrificed your men? How you alone disgraced your name? Bitch! You took everything from me! You took it from yourself. The guard know this, and none stand with you. He stands alone. This is no rebellion. It is delusion. A joke inflicted on Kirkwall, your home and mine. I will not be left with nothing again. No. You shall have less. Why would you do this? If I live to a hundred, I will never understand his kind. To the barracks, Hawk. My guardsmen will be waiting. <laughs> Too easy. Hands of glory. Cornerstone. Surprisingly, it's already junk. Dexterity. Greater ring. 16 attack, 50... Or no, 16 health, 50 attack. For any of us. Rather be free down here, I guess. All right. Back to the barracks. getting in. I've been waiting all day. Back to the barracks. I never tire of it. Jevon, son of a bitch. You build a good thing, work your hardest, and the past just claws at you. Yo, what's up, Kane? How are you? Jevon failed before he started. You know this. I do, and he doomed himself. But it smears all of the guard. I wonder what I would do if my captain lost my respect. Captain, we're waiting for orders. Will you accept them? May I speak freely? There isn't a man or woman here who wouldn't follow you through the void. Captain. I'll take it. I need a moment, Hawk, but... There is something else. Come back and talk to me. Oh, 
<laughs> and then he says, he says, I swear I had two when I came in here. <laughs> hmm. You know, those stains never came out. You are horrible. Every inch. You love it, big girl. And you owe me for the bottle. Pork. <laughs> She's not so bad. Except when she is. Did you know I've been dead for seven years? I got word last week. They only just sorted the casualties of Ostagar. The King has offered to reinstate the commission of any surviving officers who will return to Ferelden. And? And what? Does this appeal matter? I thought you were sworn to Caelan. Regardless of who has the throne, I served Ferelden. The country survives, even if Caelan didn't. You brought it up. What's your decision? It's been a strange time here in Kirkwall. Do you ever think about that last night at Ostagar? How it happened? I don't mean the betrayal. Everyone knows the signal went up and the flanking charge never came. But that moment when the tower lit and then... The fight just kept going. It was the oddest feeling. Hope answered with... nothing. I don't like the thought of going out with a whimper, Hawk. Not again. You enjoyed stringing me along too much. I can't keep a straight face for anything. But I wasn't always so sure. Thank you for everything. I have so much because of you. I'm here for you, Hawk. And for myself. Hello again, champion. Oh man. We're getting to the point where there's not much left to do. Talk to <clears throat> O, O guy. What's his name? Orsino. It's a sad moment when a game's almost over. Yeah, it's it's both sad. It, it's sad if it's a great game. It's like a relief if it's a bad game. But it's also like accomplishment because you're like, I'm glad. Like I'm I'm looking forward to seeing the end of the story, but I don't want the game to end. You know, that weird in between. Thank you for coming, champion. Few will associate with me now that I am the focus of Meredith's ire, which leaves me in a difficult position. She is not entirely wrong. Inform the criers. A miracle has occurred. I know some of my people are using dangerous means to oppose her, but I cannot seek the Templar's aid without making every mage a target. What are they doing? All I know is numerous mages have left the circle at night, sometimes for days at a time. I'd rather not follow our knight commander by leaping to the worst possible conclusion. But the idea of blood magic has crossed my mind. You need some assistance against traitors in your ranks? Traitors? Perhaps. Rebels? Certainly. I don't know if they seek congress with demons or merely a walk in the moonlight. All I know is that a meeting is happening tonight in Hightown. I would go myself, but should I leave the tower without permission, Meredith would call it proof of my involvement. I'll see what they're up to. There's no point in involving the Templars. Thank you. Your support has been a lifeline for me. For all of us. Just learn the nature of this meeting. You needn't interrupt unless you find proof of something sinister. I pray not. Or Meredith will have what she needs to justify the right of annulment. Okay. So, high town at night. <clears throat> the 
first enchanter is playing a dangerous game. Someone's coming. The champion. We know you're spying for Orsino. Run. We'll handle this. There's mages involved. Weird. Search them. See if there's any further evidence of their plans. Somebody get an upgrade? I don't know who did. All right. Go to Garibaldi's warehouse at the Low Town docks. Going to be too big of a problem. Oh yeah, Templars and Mages do not get along, that's for certain. Superior Mall. Nope, mine's better. I told you he was after us. No, not him. I can't do this. To arms! 
Vamos. I told them not to do it, I swear. If I knew you were the one they were talking about, I'd have warned you. I don't hold with kidnapping. Not after what I went through. Didn't I save your life? You did. Believe me. I still dream about those blood mages. I don't know where I'd be without you. I'd never have let them kidnap anyone I knew was one of yours. What are you talking about? They said someone was spying. We needed leverage. Someone they cared about, as a hostage. We just got word they pulled some girl from the circle. A sister, I think. Just tell me where they went. I can't waste any time. They left for the ruins on the wounded coast. We have a kind of base there. They, they should have just talked to you. I know you're a reasonable person. You have to see how dangerous Meredith is. Thrask says Meredith will cause open war with the mages if she stays in charge. We have to take her down. Is this whole thing to oust the Knight Commander? She needs to go, don't you see? We need a real Viscount and Templars who protect mages, not massacre them. Just look what Thrask accomplished. Mages and Templars working together. Isn't that what we all want? Is Thrask the one running this conspiracy? He's the one who brought us together. For six years, he's been working, one mage, one Templar at a time, teaching us we don't have to hate each other. He showed us Meredith isn't the only way. Do you mean the Templar, Thrask? You've worked with him. He's a good man. You should help us, not fight us. All we want is someone sane in Meredith's place. What are you going to do to Thrask? To me? This isn't going to end well. If I were you, I'd stay out of range. Thank you. I'm really sorry you were the one. I'll go to Marsha, try to wait this out. I don't think I can serve the Templars while Meredith is still in charge. of mercy. <clears throat> What's that blade of mercy? Oh. Apparently nothing?
Excuse me, puppy. Well, he needs another room. So many deaths could have been avoided if they just talked to me. I mean, welcome to most video games, right? <laughs> if these two people would just talk to each other for five minutes, the whole thing would just resolve itself. back to my house to heal. Uh, is there anything on the table? I don't think so. I think the game tells me that. Yeah. Renegade's coat is Anders. The so one defense... Meryl, Sebastian, Ants of Glory were ass. Alright, so we just need one defensive. Don't have it. You played this game before, Kane? No. guessing oh well yeah I was just curious because like I'm also wanting to do some prep work before the final mission so I I want to make sure the, like when is the final mission does the game warn me like hey don't go here unless you're ready to end the game because then I'm gonna go and load up on a whole bunch of like health potions Hello.
You've been sticking your nose in every problem in Kirkwall since you stumbled off the boat. Who are you again? Samson. I'm the one who fouled up your lad Fainriel's escape some years ago. Further back, I was a Templar, but that was before your time. Are the mages here using blood magic? It always comes down to that, don't it? They claim innocence, demand equality, but back them into a corner, and they got options we don't. Haven't found a mage yet who won't take it. Are you part of this plot against Meredith? You could say so. That bitch threw me out of the Templars for carrying letters from a mageling to his sweetheart. She's got her sword so far up her ass, she can cut you with her tongue. Shouldn't you be in with the rest of them? I'd hoped with Meredith gone I could take up the shield again. But maybe she was right. Give them a hint of freedom, mages go bad. Your friends are right. Without Meredith, Kirkwall can be at peace again. Mages and Templars. Working together. I must be dreaming. Is it that simple? I'd cheer to see her ship to Val Royo. But I don't have the stomach to turn against all that's right and natural to do it. Hmm. Hello. I suppose it was too much to hope that you wouldn't have come here. Though I can't understand why you side with Meredith now. You showed me we can stand up to her. When you fought off Karas's thugs to save those mages. Please, champion. I have nothing but respect for you. It's Meredith we must see gone. Your cause is just, but I take issue with your methods. I should have known you recognize the threat Meredith poses. I am sorry for any distress we caused you or your friends. Let the hostage go. No. The girl dies. Then the champion. Stand down, Grace. Grace? We saved you. What are you doing? We will not kill an innocent to achieve our ends. It gains us nothing to become Meredith. Meredith? What do I care for Meredith? I'm here for the champion. Whatever you want, just tell me. Decimus was right. There is no way for a mage to live by the Chantry's laws. You killed the best man I ever met, but I learned all he had to teach. Elaine, kill the hostage! I... I don't know, Grace. I thought you turned your back on blood magic when you saw what happened to Decimus. You don't know what it's like. We're locked in our cells all day, no light, no air. The Templars ask things of us. When Thrask offered a chance to make a better circle, I had to take it. But... Grace, this isn't right. Meredith's to blame for what's happening, not the champion. Don't defy me, boy. Without me, you'd be nothing. If you're too squeamish, I'll do it myself. No. No one has to die here. <laughs> oh, but that's where you're wrong. Restrain yourself. Forget the hostage. Kill the champion. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's take a little look-see around here. Stab that guy. Do me a favor and take him on.
I tried to stay away from her, you know, after Decimus. But the circle here is worse than Starkhaven ever was. It seemed like hers was the only way out. I... I'm sorry. Grace used blood magic to hold her. That's the only way I can bring her out. What happened? The last thing I remember is these Templars coming into my quarters. I promise. I'll never let anything like this happen again. Thank you. It's good to know you're still looking out for me. They're meeting in here, Sir Callan. Oh, I guess you didn't get on so well with these mages as you thought. Champion, Samson never said you were involved in this. I trust you were here to stop these traitors, not join them. The Champion's a good man, sir. He tried to solve things peacefully. Yeah. Put the mage to questioning. The boy stood up to his elders when they would have killed an innocent hostage. Hm. <laughs> you mean he was one of them, save for a convenient last-minute change of heart? I'll encourage Meredith to take it easy on him. Thank you, Champion. Everyone else here is under arrest. Take them to the gallows. Is there any recommendation you would have me bring to Meredith, Champion? If you killed every man who doubted Meredith's fitness, Kirkwall would be a ghost town. You think that reason enough to spare blood mages and their willing dupes? <sighs> Perhaps some of them might still be saved. Don't be a dumbass, dude. This is really annoying because the options are like... Uh... The options are like... Don't kill, don't kill a single person ever, or they all deserve to die. It's like, well, it's not so black and white, you know? <laughs> There's some nuance here. Come on. Renners might like the Blade of Mercy. Speak to him as his high talent manager. We also need to sell a bunch of stuff. Uh, it's, it's not critical, but I have a bunch of things marked as junk. remember hardly anybody from the first game. I think that's probably why when I play Inquisition, I'll probably try to do it relatively soon after this one, so I remember more of it. I think a seven-year break is a bad idea. I'll probably play, play like one or two games, one or two of my bigger title single player games between now and then, but maybe like before the end of the year I'll try to start it or something. Um, let's go to High Town. I want to sell and I want to Fenris.
Good day, Captain Abilene. All quiet around here, Captain. Good. Carry on. Take a look at this. A blade of mercy. I remember these. You see them in the Imperium. Replicas of the sword Archon Hasarian used to kill Andraste. This one looks finely crafted. I thought it might be worth something. It is. Here, let me show you. These are gifts of honor given to those who have performed a service for the Imperium. Denarius coveted them, as I recall. You don't talk about the Imperium much. It's not a place I remember fondly. Doesn't the Chantry forbid mages to rule over men? <laughs> ah, yes. Magic is meant to serve man and not rule over him. In the Imperium, they say that means magic should serve the greater good which they claim the Magisters do. Do not believe it. What do the Magisters do that's so bad? What you call the Circle of Magi rules the Imperium. They control the Chantry as well as the Templars. They claim the Magisters are governed by holy law, but they are the law. They do as they please, all of them. So they all use forbidden magic? The more powerful the Mage, the higher he rises in the Senate. He makes the laws, he determines what is acceptable. Everyone who wishes to compete must do the same, or be crushed. Perhaps it wasn't always this way, but it is now. I heard that the Imperium has been at war with the Kunari for decades. Ever since the Kunari landed on the island of Saharan, yes. Eighty years ago? Perhaps more. The Archon demanded aid from the rest of Thedas. It didn't get him far. They've been at war a long time. The Kunari only ever wanted Saharan, which they have. The Imperium has made numerous attempts to retake the island, without real success. I believe the Kunari are saving their strength, building a massive fleet. When they wish true war, we will know. Are the Kunari that strong? They once fought all the lands of Thedas to a standstill. If they wanted to conquer the Imperium, they would. From what I saw on Sir Heron, they will not relent. They believe even more strongly than the Magisters that they are in the right. The slave trade is still in operation in the Imperium. It varies from one Archon to the next. One outlawed it many years ago. He was quickly assassinated. Tevinter would crumble without slaves. The Imperium's elite know no other way. Seems like a slave rebellion would end that. There are rebellions all the time, actually. Most of them end... poorly. The Senate always unites when faced with sedition. One day, things will change. Then the Magisters will see just how fragile their hold is. I'd like you to have it. For me? Yes. I think I'd like that. I'll think of the irony as I wield it. Thank you, Hawk. Not there. Weird. Weird. Hell yeah, it's weird. Wait, can I also? I still can't choose my sister.
Hmm. Blade of Mercy might be better than the Celebrant. Three strength, three willpower. It just gives him... Not really all that worth it. All right. We'll sell it. Let's go talk to Orsino. Every time I go back in here, I want to save again because I'm like, go lock me in. Your mage Templar group was conspiring to overthrow Meredith. I have a sudden deep regret I interfered. <sighs> you know, I was half convinced Meredith had engineered the whole thing to trick me into incriminating myself. If Meredith stays in charge, she'll run Kirkwall into the ground. Speak softly, friend. There is nowhere safe to say those words. But be assured, you are not the only one thinking them. Definitely not. Please accept this as my thanks. It will be of more value to you right now than my friendship. Cumberland Circle Rose. Worthless. Hey, I leveled up to 26. Let's go. <laughs> All right, that was awesome. More willpower. Uh, let's see what else can I pick up. Holy smite, that's right. 200% versus casters and spell creatures and fade creatures. 50% uh, Oh, 50% stun chance? Ooh, I thought that was 50% additional damage. Hmm. Silence chance 100% versus normal enemies in 6 meters. Is there anything else cool I can do? No, everything else kind of sucks.
Let's give her rally. Though Thrask is dead, I didn't kill him, and his conspiracy stopped, the situation remains tense. Look for the letters from both Meredith and Orsino. The champion will likely be called to defend Kirkwall once more. Oh, so I bet you I go home. There's letters for both Meredith and Orsino asking me to overthrow the opposite one. And I have to make the decision, most likely. Like, that's probably the, like, this is the last mission. You can only do one or the other. That would make sense. Although they they really do not do a good job of making it seem like Meredith, siding with Meredith is the right decision. It's like they're trying to shove, uh, shove that down your throat. Okay, go to the gallows. Strange how to met just never come while you're home. Do I have any I wanna check the other people real quick just to make sure? Bless you, Cappy. Just to make sure they don't need um, runes. Kane said, shut up. Uh. I don't think she believed me. Kane's all offended. Hey! <laughs> All right, everybody is ready. You know what that means? Let's stop for the night. 